Six-year-old Helga takes Cassandra, 14, to school. But what might look like a little quality time between generations of the same family is in fact the work of an agency connecting children with granny au pairs. Cassandra's mother is a flight attendant and away from home 12 days a month, so Helga, from the northern German city of Hamburg, has come to live in Biot in the south of France to help out. What's important to me is that during my time away, there's someone who can make sure there's continuity in my daughter's life, in terms of sports, eating, doing the shopping, someone who can be there in case there's a problem while I'm away. For Helga, who has two adult children, leaving home as a granny au pair allowed her to break out of her familiar routine and discover a new part of the world, even if it is not always easy to build ties with a family she didn't know before. It is better to have a young girl as an au pair, because then she can be like a sister. But can't it be like having a granny? Yes, but I already have a granny. We eat together, we cook together, we talk. It's just daily life. But I don't feel like a mother or a grandmother to her. That's just not possible in eight weeks. The service is the brainchild of 50-year-old Michaela Hansen. In Hamburg, her granny au pair agency brings generations together, uniting kids abroad with their own German Mary Poppins. And German's image as solid and dependable seems to apply to its grannies, too. These women married young. They had their own children. They worked, or some of them studied. They couldn't go abroad when they were young, maybe because it wasn't done back then. Now they can go near or far depending on their interests. A few have even made it as far as India and Australia.